Sometimes, despite our best efforts, even after we tune Android Studio and the emulator, the emulator continues to run too sluggishly to be of practical use. Or, perhaps you just want to try out your app in a physical device to get the look and feel of it. For these situations, the best option might be to run apps directly on a physical device, such as the Google Pixel shown here. Note that before starting the process of trying to run this on a physical device, you need to make sure that ADB drivers are installed on your PC or Mac. We're not going to go over the process of how to do this, but there are plenty of videos available on YouTube that describe the process for installing these ADB drivers. I'm using a tool called Visor right now to show you what's on my physical device, but what you need to do is you need to go on your phone and turn on the developer mode. To do that, you're going to go over to settings and you're going to scroll all the way down till you get to this bottom prompt that says about phone. After you click on that, what you want to do is you want to go to the bottom again and find this build number. Tap several times. Now you can see I'm getting a message saying I'm already a developer, but when you click on the build number several times, you will eventually be told that you have become a developer. Now, if we go back one menu, you can see that there's going to be a new option shown here called Developer Options. Simply click on that, and you want to make sure that your USB debugging option is turned on. At this point, you want to take a USB cable, connect one end to your mobile device, and the other into the USB port on your computer. Once you do that, you'll be able to use your cell phone to download apps running in Android Studio. Let's first start off by turning off the emulator. Now, when you hit the Run button on Android Studio, you can see that in addition to the emulator showing up as a choice, your actual physical device is also one of the choices shown. If I choose to run my app on the Google Pixel now, you can see it showing up right here. In many cases, this can be a faster option than using the emulator.